In this video, I'll be helping you with the Alex problem type called finding a financial amount in a word problem on exponential growth or decay. For this example, we're told the principal of $4,800 is invested at 3% interest, and we're asked to find out how much the investment will be in 10 years and to round to the nearest dollar. In previous examples, we've shown that the interest compounding could be calculated each year by starting with the amount of the investment and then adding the interest. Here that 3% annual interest would be calculated by taking the principal, 4,800, and multiplying by the decimal equivalence of 3%. Another way of viewing this calculation is that it is the principal times here 1.03 where multiplying by 1 gives us the original amount, and then the 0 0.3 adds the interest onto the original amount, but in one step, one calculation multiplying by 1.03. And then each year after, we would continue to multiply by 1.03 to get the previous amount plus that 3% interest in one calculation. So for example, year 2, we would have that original amount times the 1.03 adding the interest from year one and another 1.03 adding the interest from year two. Continuing this pattern, we could calculate the value at any year by taking that original amount, 4,800 here, and multiplying by 1.03 raised to a power that is the number of years that interest is being added. So for example, for 10 years, we would have the original 4,800 times 1.03 raised to the 10th power. And if we put this into a calculator, here I use Desmos, we would enter the original 4,800, and then since only the 1.03 is being raised to the exponent, I like to use parentheses, 1.03, the caret to get the exponent, which here is 10. Plugging that into Desmos, we want to round our solution to the nearest dollar. And since the next digit here is a 7, we would round up. So this would be $6,451 with that rounding. 